Hi guys and welcome to C++ tutorial of hospital appointment booking system. Okay, let me show you guys how this works. You see right here we have the navigator bar. So I can just navigate using the bar or just do whatever I like with it. And uh, all of the data that we have in here, they are also saved straight into the database, the access database. Let me open it for you guys. It's coming up and open up the table there we go those are the data that I have in there so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to enter a new record in there okay new patient details so click on this plus sign there we go now I'm going to come right here you see where we have the patient ID and this patient let's assume is Mrs and the name is Mary and the name is Mary Kings. Address of Miss Kings number one. Goes. Let's say goes down. Nationality. Let's assume she is or something else. Let's say she's British. And in here, appointment booked date of appointment and let's assume the date of appointment we can pick that up here 26 and time of appointment we can make that about yep yeah. and is it confirmed yes our telephone number gender female to the date of birth in there let's say she was born on the and there now that we automatically calculate the age as you can see and right here the county let's say the county is Frogner County okay telephone number okay a work telephone number let's say and mobile number email address let's say that's an email at gmail.com and doctor doctor's ID title doctor of course a name of doctor is John John Johnson yeah there we go so those are the details of these very patients including the details of the doctor so if we come in here you see the appointment details that's Mary's details in there right there okay the other thing is let's check if Mary's details is on the database so I'm gonna go straight to the database now let's go back to the database come right in here double click on appointment and right here that's Mary's details there and just for your information guys this is just an overview and I'll see you guys with a full tutorial shortly bye for now